FeatureCam 2016 R3 now benefits from a direct link with an Autodesk collaboration tool known as A360. With the ability to view, share and review over 50 CAD formats directly in a browser, collaboration with a team has never been easier. So to access A360 from within FeatureCam, the link can be found within the Help menu and Autodesk A360. By clicking on this link, this will navigate you to the A360 homepage where you simply sign in and you are presented with the different projects that you are involved in. Your data is split up into different projects for easier data management. By clicking on its name, this opens the project allowing you to see the data inside. As you can see, there is one file that Robert Walker has uploaded for our attention. By clicking on this, we can benefit from the online viewer, which enables us to view a wide variety of different CAD file formats directly from the browser without the need for any software. The viewer benefits from a variety of different viewing options, which can be accessed through the bottom toolbar as well as different markup options and the ability to section your part. By selecting Overview in the top right hand corner, we can see any recent activity. From this view, we can see that Rob has added a comment. Hi Spencer, here's the part we need in 302 stainless steel. How quickly can you get this programmed and get the NC code back to us? At this point, I can reply to Rob, telling him I'll get this done right away. I'm also going to ask him what post he'd like me to use. At this point I'll post and in the meantime what I can do is download this file using the download link at the top right hand corner. And once this is downloaded I can switch to FeatureCam and start programming. So at this point you can see that I've imported my part and created a setup in the centre of my model. At this point what I'll do is I'll enter into the stock properties material and I'll select the 302 stainless steel that Rob asked for in his comment. At this point what I'm going to do is I'm going to run the automatic feature recognition function within FeatureCam and this will generate all the features we need to program our part. At this stage I'm going to navigate back to A360 to see if Rob's left any more comments and as you can see, he wants us to program the part using a DMG DMC 60T post. So by navigating back to FeatureCam, entering the post options, I can simply select the post that he requested, run a 3D simulation to verify the toolpaths. This also allows us to visualize the process as well as collision checking between the tool and the part. And at this stage our NC code has been generated and you can view this using the NC code tab. At this stage I'll save our NC program so that I can upload it to A360 for Rob to start machining. So by switching back to A360, by entering back into the project, I can simply upload a file, the adapter plate, and once this is uploaded Rob will be notified that a new file has been uploaded and he can start machining right away.